It's a Christmas craft video. Hi guys, I'm Libby and welcome to Punzi's Palace where I do all things Disney, hence the Punzi, and all things regarding my life and home, hence my palace. So if you haven't already, be sure to hit subscribe down below for more Disney and lifestyle content. All right guys, so today I'm doing a craft video. This is a Christmas craft video. More than that, it is a Disney Christmas craft video and we are making three ornaments. So I'm trying to make it three different types of ornaments because you can make a million of this one kind and just different variations, but I wanted to make three different types of ornaments. So we have a felt ornament, we have more of a crafty styrofoam ornament, as well as a classic glass ball ornament. So the first ornament that we made was a Santa Mickey felt ornament, and I will show you all of the items that you will need, as well as how I went about making this. So I forgot to film this first part, but basically just take some red felt and I trace it out in marker. You'll need two Mickey heads, and then you'll need some black felt. You can trace that with some chalk instead of a sharpie since it's black and I made it just a little bit longer than the mickey to go across and this will be sewn on like so like that and I did two pieces one for the front and one for the back and then out of the yellow a little belt buckle only one like that so this is what our Santa Mickey little ornament will look like. You can hot glue everything onto the Mickey ornament or you can glue and sew or just sew. I did a combination of hot gluing and sewing the belt on. And then once the belt and belt buckle are attached to the red Santa head, then you will want to use some thread to sew around most of your ornament. Also make sure that you attach the hanging piece to your ornament and make sure that you either hot glue or sew that in before you sew over it just so you can make sure that that is in there. And then before you get to the very end of sewing up your Mickey head, make sure that you stuff it, make sure it's nice and puffy, get it into all the little crevices and his ears, and then all you have to do is sew up the rest of it. Santa felt Mickey head. Pretty nice, pretty cute, pretty easy. It's very easy if you know how to sew. Even if you don't know how to sew, you can still pretty much just go in and out, but otherwise you can also just use a lot of hot glue and that'll work just as well. So that is a very easy felt ornament. You can make all kinds of different Mickeys with different patterns. You can do a reindeer one, you could do a gingerbread Mickey, but I decided to go with a simple little Santa for today. The next ornament is a styrofoam ornament, so I will show you all the things that you will need and how to make it. So what you'll need is three little styrofoam balls, one a bigger size and two smaller ones for his ears, some black felt, any kind of color ribbon, but I chose Christmas colors. So any kind of embellishments that you want. I have some paint markers here to help me do his face as well as decorate some of the ribbon. Toothpicks some scissors, and our trusty hot glue gun. So first I'm going to attach the ears, then I'll paint the face, make the little hat and attach it, and then I'll make his scarf and attach it. So the first thing that I did to make this ornament was I used some toothpicks to attach all three of the styrofoam balls together, and also some hot glue to make sure that they stuck together and one wouldn't fall off because it's just held on there by a toothpick. Next, I drew on Mickey's face using a small little paint marker. And 
And then I decided to make the hat. So I made the hat out of felt by drawing two circles, one bigger than the other on black felt, as well as one long piece of black felt to make the body of the hat. Then using some cutting, some hot gluing, I attached the hat and assembled it all together, as well as attaching some ribbon and a sequin to kind of embellish the hat a little bit. that head to the Mickey head of the styrofoam balls. I also decided to make him a cute little scarf by cutting some more ribbon and finagling it with some hot glue around the bottom of him to make it look like he was wearing a lovely winter scarf. Also make sure that you don't forget to attach the ornament hanger onto it. I always like to just use some ribbon and I use some green ribbon so it looks like it's coming off of his hat. So yes, here is our cute little Mickey, snowman Mickey head. To make him, I used all of the things that I just had in my craft closet around the house. So if I did go out and buy stuff for him, I probably would have gotten a bit smaller balls for his ears and maybe a bigger one for his head, as well as another one so I can make him have a little snowman body. But I think he still looks cute as just a little snowman head. And the last ornament that I made is a simple glass ornament. And I decided to go with making it a princess type ornament instead of just doing all Mickey stuff. You can make this any kind of princess that you want. And I know what you guys are thinking. She's gonna make a Rapunzel one. I didn't. I know, crazy, but I decided to go with another one of my favorite princesses. I went with Cinderella because I had a lot of Cinderella-y type craft things in my craft closet. So I thought, why not? So here's everything that you will need to make this ornament as well as how I made it. So you will need clear ornament like this. You will need some glitter of whatever color that you want it to be. I went with a nice white color because I'll have a lot of different blue accents. A bunch of different embellishments. I got some beads, some ribbon, some sequins, some gemstones, and some lace. All kinds of things. I may not use all of it, it just depends. I want to have some options. Either floor polish or baby oil. This is what will make the glitter stick to the inside of your ornament. Again, a hot glue gun to glue on any of your embellishments. So while the other two ornaments that I made, I got inspiration off of Pinterest, but didn't follow any specific tutorial. This one, I did follow a tutorial on how to get glitter to stick to the inside of a glass ornament. And by doing this, all you have to do is put a little bit of baby oil or floor polish inside of the ornament, swirl it around, and then put in about a tablespoon or so of glitter and swirl that around in the ornament until it sticks to everything and you are pleased with it. After that it's all creative from here and I decided to take some ribbon and folded it in half and hot glued some sequins along the bottom. as cutting up a bit of a lace headband that I had that broke and attaching that to the center to have it look like the center folds of her dress. Hot glued that onto the ornament so it would look like a nice little skirt. And then I took some little gemstone embellishments and hot glued that onto the top part of the ornament. as well as writing a little C on the front for Cindy. Here is our Cinderella ornament. I think she is pretty cute. It definitely makes me want to make a whole line of princess ornaments like this with the different kind of colors in the, on the inside. I probably will not make all 12 princesses this year, but maybe in future years. Over a few years, I'll make a whole set. All right, guys, and those are the three different kinds of ornaments that I made today. I hope you enjoyed watching these crafts. I hope it inspires you to make some crafts. If you want to copy these, feel free to. 
or if you want to take your own little spin on it like I did with the sources that I found, please feel free to do so. But that is all that I have for today, guys. There will be another craft video coming soon. Not ornaments, still Disney, and still Christmas. So stay tuned for that, and if you want to make sure that you don't miss it, be sure to hit the bell icon so you know every time that I upload. And if you like this video, guys, be sure to give it a thumbs up. And also comment down below on which of the ornaments I made today was your favorite, as well as which princess you think I should make next as a little glass ornament. And until next time, guys, farewell.